Okay. Actually, okay. and let's move a little bit more central. Start with movement number 20 of the 30. Okay, so right with that. 21, 22, 23 is a figure eight. Down to the right, back to the middle, down to the left, back to the middle. Now cover your head and your face. It's 23. Vertical eyes, hands reverse, step back right foot. Vertical eyes, thumb down, grab with the left, step back left foot. Vertical eyes, up left, down right, turn. Now here, got a long end and a short end. Test the sword in. Let go. Catch the handle. Okay, now, before you step, the tip is in the back. Full circle sweep. Step, turn, pivot. 28. Left. Right. Left. Back. 30. Okay? So that's your last 10, okay? Let's go again, just for the practice here. Step. And change. Figure eight, but two-handed. Now cover your face and your head. That's all 23. Vertical eye. Left up, right hand. Step back, right foot. Vertical eyes. Okay, this is long, short end, long end. Thumb down, right hand. Left hand grips the handle. Step back, left foot. Vertical eyes. Up, left, down, right. No turn, just no step, just a turn now. Let go. Catch. Keep us in the back. Full circle sweep. Step. Turn. Now, rotate the hip. Left hand, thumb space. Right hand, thumb space away. Left hand, thumb space. Right foot back. Okay, so that's kind of the uh, official, <laughs> but you don't. Okay. And boom. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. A little bit more forward. Okay. Okay. 
Right foot steps. Hand blade position. Figure eight, two handed. Vertical eyes. Step back, right foot, vertical eyes. Step back. That foot, vertical eyes. Just a turn, no step. Right hand releases, catch. Left hand catches the bottom. Full circle sweep, step, turn, pivot. Rotate the hip, left hand, thumbs face, right hand, thumbs face away, left hand, okay, okay. Now, for example, he's raising, he can come in with a striking motion, boom, because he's raising at the top, raise up, good. If you go that way, you just get in the face anyway. You're... Now, if that's sharp, spear point, he cut himself. So he backs off a little bit, covers his opening, not back off, but just, just instead, of, instead of leaning into a sharp point. Good. Okay. That's 21. Takes two people. All right. If you lean, lean. Lean in. This way. Good. You do that, which is more impact. Okay. All right. But he's smart. Boom. Okay. Good. All right. So, okay. okay. 21. 22. Take your right. but two-handed, okay, and three, and boom, cut, cut, good, legs up again, cut, legs <laughs> up again, cut, okay, big your right. Okay, all right, and again, coming in this direction, boom, intercept, yeah, boom, all right, good, boom, boom, I let him down a little bit, let's go again, so, boom, 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 Okay, so we go back. Now, vertical eyes, step back right foot, vertical eyes, step back left foot, vertical eyes, turn. Okay, release, right hand, spin, catch, right hand, release left, catch the bottom. The points behind you, full circle sweep, Step turns, strike or cut, hips turn. If I go like this, I might poke myself. All right, so, so. creating space left, right, left, step back, right foot. Okay, all right now, all right, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Okay? Another way of practicing that. Okay? 
Okay, so that's meant to also be one flow. Okay, now. Okay, now what we're doing is just preforming a little bit. Turn, turn, step back, step back, step back, turn, boom, and uh -huh. hmm. Okay. Now what I'm doing right there is just slicing and dicing, taking the same sequence. For example, here, it could be somebody picking up somebody coming up from the back. So boom, you turn. Somebody coming there, boom, somebody coming there, some covering from that angle. Somebody that way, or somebody that way. Whole bunch of people, boom, you sweep, boom. Pick out. Now somebody coming from the back. Oh. So just within the parameters of the last pin, there's a lot spread out. Investigate it. Okay. Now all we're doing is taking a linear sequence and changing the angles, including more circle. Go. Okay. And back to the basic. 21, 22, 23, 24, step back, 25, step back, 26, just a turn, no step back, 27. 28, 29, and 30, okay? All right, now, different angle. Different angle, different angle, different angle. Still same motion. I'm including more of a circle, okay? Or it's forming a triangle, okay? Now, there's a lot of times there's a square feeling. If you get too much into the triangle, you get a little too sharp, you're, you attack people all the time. Maybe not physically, but verbally. Yeah. I don't like your ethnic color. I don't like your religion. Yeah. I'm speaking like I'm 
I'm, I'm white and I'm not. So, you know, crazy, all right? But if you get a square two inch, you get a little too heavy. So the circle that David comes in a little bit right there, then we'll just kind of go this, go this way, this way, this way, this way, and this way. <laughs> and then this way, that's all circle. So, circle's a connector. Okay. What happens when you start to take the obvious, you know, which is the front back? That's kind of more your triangle point phase. And then, you know, this certain area will add a little too much weight to the movements. And they get, you kind of get physically stronger, but your body ages to a certain point and your body of your athleticism's gone. What do you, you're not left with much. But the circle is constantly creating a connecting area between the triangle. It's a martial art. But I want to be somebody who's attacking everybody bad mouthing everybody. And on the other hand, I don't want to be, I'm going to vote this way no matter what. I'm not going to listen to anybody. Well, I feel that way, but <laughs> one little circle that things as other people talk. You <sighs> circle allows for communication and harmony. Okay. So when we're, you know, if you're coming in this way, they're coming. Circle. Circle here. Circle here. And circle here. Circle here. He's going to get the point in the end anyway. Okay. Easy. Circle is creative. Okay. All right. Circle is a connector. All right. Let's go. Okay. But yeah, there are different energies. I'll say <laughs> triangle is sharp. Come on. <laughs> sharp. <laughs> Don't bring those racist statements into my group. <laughs> but I uphold your right to free speech. Yeah. The circle the circle is present even when the triangle seems to be dominant. But he's coming in this direction, we go like that. There's a weight to the square. But no. huh? yeah. the circle is ever vigilant without being paranoid. Pretty cool. Right? It's coming. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Circle allows for naturalness to happen as opposed to a rigid approach or a dogmatic approach. They're, they're, they're close, rigid, inflexible, dogmatic. Just sees my own viewpoint. Okay. All right. What? Right. 21. 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 
29, 30. Okay. Yeah. So those are movements, but there's a lot there. Now, for example, we have the two-handed figure eight. So I, I can continue to go that way or that way. Or conversely, if you still mean it, I can go the opposite. I can go left first, right back. But within the set, we go right first, back to the left, cover. If he's coming straight here, then we go straight and back. Boom. All right. Or conversely, without the weapon. Come on, just keep it good. Okay. So adaptable. The circle is very adaptable. It's a connector. Okay. Now, what I want you to do off of now, figure eight change. Figure eight change to fire water change. Yeah. Thumb down. Thumb up, thumb down, thumb up, thumb down, thumb up, thumb down, thumb up. Thumb down. Let's just call it fire. Thumb up, water. Fire and water create. The water can burn the fire off. It can douse the fire. The fire can burn the water off. But they combustion. Okay. Now. Back to the figure eight. Fire water change. Back to the figure eight. Fire water change. Back to the figure eight. Okay. Fire. Fire. Figure eight, figure eight. Fire water. Goes the other way too. Thumb down, thumb up, thumb down, thumb up. Fire, water, fire, water. Figure eight um, is wire and fire kind of creating together. Okay? All right? Where do we see that? There he comes in with the striking motion here. Yeah. Fire water. Fire water. Fire water. Fire water. Very easy. Huh? Fire water. Fire water. Fire water. These are the movements. Okay, all right. He comes with a motion here. Oh, water. <laughs> he gets up. Oh, we're ready to. He comes to that. Okay, good. Come on in. Oh, okay. as long as he knows to stretch and fall with it, it's safe. We're doing a two-person yoga. If he doesn't go, he might pump that, that would, those things were meant to work through samurai armor. I lose my sword or spear. He's wearing armor. Chew that armor. Boom. Right? So the connector. There's a creative tension between fire, water, water, fire. Ah, okay. So anyway, they got um okay, thanks. Then yeah. okay, good. 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 Okay. good. 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 Now we're not gonna all right. You get the we're not just waving the arms around here. Hmm. 
is that? That's six. That's the number seven, isn't it? Huh? And huh? you see movement number seven here. Or what's up with that? What's happening? Delivery. After Robert Nadell or something. Circle, continue. Okay, so those are just a couple of things as you continue to evolve. Let's go through the... Okay. 21, 22, 23, 24, step back, 25, step back, 26, just a turn, no step, 27, and part of that is that sweep, step, turn, that's all, now this is 28. 29, 30 is a step back, okay? But there's a lot more than just the sequence of everything. Put that to the side, roll off. Okay. Now, let's just say right here, he grabs with two hands firm with weight. <laughs> The energy flow. Huh? Okay, so uh, different camera angle. <laughs> okay. Let's do the modo te dori ko kyuho. This is say, you know, you've got all these wonderful ideas and dreams and the world comes in and puts its weight on. Easy to. Okay. Easy with it. That flow, your idea is still there. Your vision is still there. The world can be kind of done. Okay. All right. Go. Oh, I think I forgot that. No.
Um, one of the things that happens a bit right there, for example, it starts out really well, but then we come in the shoulders a little too quick. Mm -hmm. right. He grabs here. The hips are free. Easy ground, deep ground. Flat, that's a deep ground. Sure. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So when you're here, it starts out well for you. I think you come from the shoulders of James. Okay. Thank you. Let's go. Better, better, better. Now better, better. Now you had a better base on that one. And the beginnings of a better base, okay? All right, not because you squatted better. Came together better through you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay, now he's got some weight to him. If you turn your shoulder in too quick to him, no, you don't. Mm -hmm. oh. And your shoulder on too quick. Okay. Go. Now right there, then it can be caught up down there. You're standing on the ground, you got an idea. Well I'll see. Little we'll suit goes into a mighty redwood. All right. I'm feeling a little bit like that. You plant a little thing and then you, you put rocks on top of it. You don't water or anything. Or something. Mm -hmm. You don't just plant up, but see, you got the oh, under support okay. and you go that way. Okay. Better? Yeah, that was nice. Yeah. Good. <laughs> now, the other thing. Okay. Backing off, you create distance that eventually creates that. Okay. Good. All right. Backing off creates distance, which then may create a collision. Right where you are. Right where you are. Right where you are. The answer is always right where you are. If you're about to get run over, buy a truck or something and get to the side. That's right where you are. You make the right decision. <laughs> Avoiding something may not be a truck, just might be a nightmare. Okay, go again. Good, 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 good. yes. I didn't have so much of a hole in it, you feel? You were a little bit more dialed in, so to speak, more squared away with the situation. You didn't give ground away by backing away or turn the shoulder in too quick to get a result. Just right where we are, keep going. Yeah, that's good. That's good, okay.
Yeah. Um, when you're looking for wiggle room, okay, you don't get the wiggle room out there mm. because when you do that, you're closing a bigger door. You're scooting around an issue. Right? Wiggle room's created down here. Mm. Mm. Right? I may get you a little bit right there, but I created another block. The wiggle room's crazy mm. down there. Created your hips core with a nice ground support. Okay? Oh. Careful being too quick out there. Your, your right idea in the moment gets blocked kind of quick. Okay? That's, yeah, that's better. What you did, you picked up a fuller body. Not so much trying the ideas out here. You finally just relaxed, caught a little bit more fullness, okay? All right. Yeah, that was good. that was good. What, what happens a little bit? Uh, there's a there's a movement. Do, do, do. Back. A movement back. But if I may play that card too quick, it jams up. So you, you got your feet, you mm. got your mm. your upper center, right? And then you turn. If you turn with one of them, it jams up. My idea. It's correct, it's just I don't have the tools. I don't have me right there. My mind and body are just not communicating. Likewise, this is good. And it jams up, right? The up, down, center. Mm -hmm. and then that. Yeah. You are, you create your own tools by creating yourself to be in the proper state of mind to body, body to mind. Go ahead. That's better. Yeah. yeah, that one. Okay. Bruce Lee would say that one. I mean, <laughs> you're in a fuel state. Yes. Okay. Okay, now hold it for the Crossfit step, which means in crossfit you can't set or you get knocked back, and you can't lean in, or they'll just 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 lock on you. Hips, but right here you're playing the upper card too quick. All right? Any one of those movements, to be honest with you, is infinite. Okay. We learn stuff. Then we got to realize we don't know anything at all. And not knowing anything at all is freedom. Right? 
It's freedom here. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah. Come on. You don't want to know anything. You just want to be kind of there in a, in a very easy state. It's relational. I'm going to actually get these ideas and I'm going to make you wrong because you're the wrong color or the wrong party or something stupid. Okay? So, easy there, easy. Okay. Okay, all right. Okay. Everybody have a seat. Yeah. Same attack right here, but what we're going to do is going to go over here. Right here. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Use the term drop the piece of paper in the waste paper basket. Don't miss the basket. Easy. Okay. On the other hand, the weight of the paper doesn't do anything, but the relaxation around that image creates a flow. All right. So what happens right here? Okay. Okay. Can we tell somebody to relax? Okay. But when I move, I, I get uptight. So I'm reacting to hmm. reacting to the situation. Now the weight of the piece of paper is not going to create the technique, but the relaxation here creates your energy to move to where it needs to move. Okay, if he's coming in this direction, good, 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 good. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, Whoa. Okay. Oh, here we are. And so when you say you're not using strength, um, the strength works to a level. And then basically you realize after a while your partner can use strength. So, you know, part of learning how to get into more of an energy flow requires some kind of reframing. So we say sometimes, like right here, he grabs the two. Okay, good. Over here. Now I'm going to change my position because he's got this hand here and extend back through that hand. So I change the angle. Up. Uh, hips. 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 Off an easy ground. Reactive. I'm gonna fight you for turf. Easy. This planet belongs to everybody here. <laughs> All right. War is really insanely stupid. But there are egos. Nationalistic, racial, political. Now I'm gonna kind of rotate the hip and right here, it's gonna drop that piece of paper, but it's not the piece of paper in its way, it's stuck the energy between. Well, I'm not gonna throw the paper. 
I'm not going to try to pick up a heavy weight and drop it on his wrist. Easy. Okay, so let's switch to the new heel, all right? Thank <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Good. Yeah. Keep going. Okay. Yeah. See, it's not the weight of the paper. It's the fact that the image of that frees up your key. Okay. If you have the ability to just drop a piece of paper in the waste paper basket, any idiot can do that. But the ability, when you're under pressure in a situation where you feel like you get mechanical and reactive, is be in that space where your imagination says it's as easy as that paper drop. I imagine, you know, Stephen Curry hit that golden dagger shot. It was a horrible play. He was double team, so he threw the ball to a teammate. All right. And the teammate who was who should have shot it or passed it threw it back to Curry. He was being <laughs> double teamed. That was horrible. But he created a special moment. And when he got the ball back, I think he realized he was supposed to shoot it over two gigantic guys who just were right on him that for the glory of France. <laughs> And it probably felt to him like he was dropping a piece of paper in the wastebasket. It was a hell of a lot of energy. So the ability sometimes to, to do that, you know, if you're, for example, coming in this direction. And if he's coming in this direction, good, 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 good. And if he's coming this direction, this direction, boom. And he's going, boom. <laughs> You're easy with the situation, not sloppy. Okay? And your energy flows when you're in that state. It's a difference between I'm learning about flow and flow is the reality of it. You're in a universe of flow. And by being easy with that state, flow flows for you. It's like Curry with these two big giants all over him, falling back on one leg from over 30 feet, just dropping that piece of paper right into the waste paper basket. He was so good, the French said he was Satan. He was the devil to them. Oh, it's kind of a compliment. He said, I'm not going to use that nickname. <laughs> okay. But if he's coming in, there's a good, come on, good, good, good. easy, 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 easy. 
Easy is not easy. We're reactive there, therefore the ability to stand in that space, that flow space, so that flow can flow through you, is a lot of what we're trying to develop. So the, the stuff with the uh, the staff, this, if you take it past the numbers, there's a lot of building blocks there. Okay, um, let's go. Come on, let's body. Good. Now, this is the obvious. Okay. So let's take that obvious and realize there's an equal and opposite wave there. This is the obvious. But let's take the obvious and realize there's an equal and opposite wave. This is the obvious. Yes, but. Well, I do realize this. An equal and opposite wave there. And you don't get that equal and opposite wave until you're sort of tuned into the flow space. I know it. I'm going to do it. You've got to be easy there. That's why beginner's mind is very real. As a teacher, you see somebody, they're in beginner's mind. They do it perfectly. Then all of a sudden, they come back a big, tough brown belt. They've totally lost it. <laughs> it's a really funny state. David, I think, understands that. But yeah, yeah. Well, it was so easy. It was so natural. Now I know something. Easy there. Yes. <laughs> right? Okay. So anyway, the, the movement, see, we're, we're doing our normal Hokunaga here, but there's an equal and opposite way there. Also, oh, that step back, you, you, you feel that for me, but you also begin yeah. to sense and feel the equal and opposite way. Okay, so let's work that reversal there, okay? Right, David, let this one build a little bit more. Okay. That's so Jewish. I'm Sandy Koufax. <laughs> and I've got this curve that drops straight to the ground. And when you're looking for that, I'm going to throw my 100 mile an hour fastball. <laughs> the NPN, the NPN. Okay. Hmm. That's a fait accompli, but we, we say there's another force here. <laughs> it's useful also to get acquainted with, all right? It's how we expand our repertoire, so to speak. So, yes, yes. So let it build, let it build, let it build, let it build. Yes. The whole, it's a whole other. I get so enamored of this one that we miss. She's equal. More than equal somewhere. Okay? All right? Go.
Yeah. Now, what are the things right there, for example? Once you've collided with somebody, it's yeah. a little hard. So remember the first one, it's expensive. Oh. It's a wave. Huh. It's about to cross that way, but it also kind of crossed on itself like this. Oh. Right? Now, those are always there. You grab my wrist. Huh? As you squeeze in, is an equal and opposite force that goes my way. Okay? There's always a yin to a yang, a yang to a yin. There's an obvious, there's always the less obvious. Okay, what I was kind of saying a little bit right here, this is like he, this is very obvious. This is very obvious. You just keep going that way. But it's kind of nice to realize he has a partner that's he more than equal. Boom. Right? This is the obvious, the obvious, the obvious, yes. We can get too tired of that one. We realize, boy, <laughs> there's an obvious to a less obvious. In fact, she's actually after that no fun to hang out with. Boom. <laughs> okay. Right. Yeah, I know. <laughs> we we put so much into the obvious that uh, the less obvious sometimes gets crowded out. Okay, and the less obvious are trying to speak to us. Okay. Well, since I was obviously an old man who should be decrepit and mentally, physically, emotionally, probably starting to really wind down, but he had a partner. He had the universe. This is Ella. Pretty good. Okay. Anyway, let's line up. Okay. Okay, thank you very much. And my whole apparatus is about ball. Let's make sure it doesn't. Yeah. Okay. Remember on November the 17th, Okay, that's a Sunday. We're not doing the Sunday class. We're encouraging everybody to go to Aikido West on Sunday, a Saturday, sorry, the 16th. Okay, now those Sensei's book signing and there's a workshop. Okay, I'll be there in some capacity too. Okay. And again, that's, that's kind of an important one. We don't have that many events these days. You know, and so that's a huge event for our division, Division Three. Okay, and also a, a huge division, a huge event for Aikido in this area. In those sense, I, it's one of the real pioneers. Okay, and so you know, supporting the history of the area, I really appreciate it that we can make a an effort to to actually attend that. If not, you know, I mean. It's not supposed to rule your life, but on the other hand, uh, it's important. Okay. Um, so anyway, some of the stuff we did with the class today is just a microcosm. We started out with the 30 movements or the last 10 movements. But David, if you can post this one fairly quickly, because I'm doing exams off of this at San Jose State. And everybody's having trouble with this last 10. 
And so you might, if you can post it pretty quickly, I'd appreciate it. I can then post it online and send it to the students and you'll probably go, oh, okay. Because there's a lot of um, the actual first, second sets of 10. Each of them, well, basic foundation, triangle, full moon, half moon, quarter moon, no moon. That's first thing. Second set of 10, you, you get the changes. Ikkyo, Sankyo, Yonkyo, okay? And then the uh, last set of 10, what do you get? You, you get the fire water changes. You get the two-handed figure eight, okay? And we expand upon our, our movements there. So, you know, I'm trying to get them to where they're not totally crazy about the last 10. Go, oh, that's what it is, okay? So I appreciate it if we could do that. Um, anyway, that's about it. So thank you. Thank <sighs> you.